So Acrocanthosaurus is not preserved in the right environment to show definitively whether it had feathers or not. And that happens with a lot of dinosaurs. So what we do is we look to their close relatives on the family tree to figure out if their cousins and their descendants and their ancestors do have evidence of feathers. Um, it's likely that Acrocanthosaurus had downy feathers on its body, not the kind that are stiff like modern bird feathers, but kind of a fluffy kind of feather. We call it dino fuzz. Um, as far as how much it would have covered Acro's body, that's a little bit of a different story because of the size of Acrocanthosaurus. We don't have anything that large um, in terms of carnivorous or meat-eating dinosaurs that has direct evidence of feathers. So we're not sure how much of Acrocanthosaurus's body would have been covered.